Hello, welcome to this video. It's Lena Che from DetailLena.com and in today's video tutorial, we are going to talk about crypto loan. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to get a loan with your crypto and how you can equally um, participate in the loaning aspect of it by, you know, lending out your funds to make interest on it on a daily basis. And the platform I'll be leveraging on in this video tutorial is the OKX Crypto Loan. Okay, so we're going to look at how the OKX Crypto Loan works, how you can participate as a borrower or how you can participate as a lender. In both ways, you can make interest from both ways, okay? So basically, when we talk about crypto loan, we, just like any type of loan that you know of, but in the crypto space, you can use your own crypto asset as collateral to borrow money, or you can lend out your own crypto asset, okay? If you have some crypto already, instead of just letting it sit in your wallet, you can actually lend it out and be earning interest on it on a daily, depending on um, the durations and the terms of the loan that you're going into. It could be on a hourly basis, on a daily basis, and so on, okay? So basically, the OKS exchange, to be able to assess that, with the OKS exchange, you can actually lend out your funds to earn money and you can equally use your asset to borrow funds. okay? Now to understand why you should use your crypto as collateral is because uh, let's say you have one Bitcoin, okay? And then you bought that one Bitcoin when Bitcoin was around 60, 60,000, 68,000 or 69,000. And then all of a sudden this happens, okay? The market just dropped to where it is right now. Instead of selling your crypto out of panic, instead of selling it and at lost, what you can do is you can come on platform like OKS, okay? You lend that Bitcoin to them, right? And they will pay you daily interest. Or you can use that Bitcoin as collateral to borrow USDT. And you can use USDT to trade other coins, you know, to acquire other coins now that the price is down, okay? When the price is down, you can acquire other tokens like buy any tokens that the price is down right now. And then when the price starts rising up, you can sell, return back the loan you borrowed in USDT, okay, with the interest in it, and then you get back your one Bitcoin, all right? If you have two Bitcoin, whatever it is, instead of selling it, you can use it to borrow more money, use it to uh, use the USDT to trade, and at the end of the day, you return the borrowed money with the interest on it, and you give back your own profit that you have made and you still get back your Bitcoin or your Ethereum, okay? That is basically one of the advantages of, you know, doing this borrowing fund. Then if you're a lender, you can just lend your asset and be earning interest from it on a daily basis. So to be able to assess the loan uh, option on the, to be able to assess the loan option on the OKS um, exchange, all you need to do, I think I need to demonstrate this with the phone, okay, so that everybody will need to follow up. Let me do it on, demonstrate this on the mobile phone so that you should be able to follow up. All right, so here I am on my phone. All I just need to do is to open up the OKS app, okay? So if you have the OKS app, go ahead and open it. If you can do this on the phone, it means that you can easily do that on the desktop or the web version of the OKS website, okay? All right, so once you open up the app, once you log in into the app, first thing you need to do to be able to assess the loans, you see here where it says loans. So you can see here where it says loans, okay? So we can just go ahead and click on that. This is for those who want to borrow, all right? So if you want to borrow, you can use the borrow. As you can see here, you see the option borrow and then lend. If you want to lend, you can use the lending option. If you want to borrow, you use the borrow option, okay? So to start with, let's say you want to borrow, you go ahead and click on borrow, okay? In order to be able to borrow, you need a crypto, an asset to use as collateral. So as I explained initially, it means that you bought Bitcoin or Ethereum and then the price is dropping. So instead of selling at loss, what you can do is that you can use that funds to borrow USDT, okay? And when you borrow USDT, you can use that to start trading. And then when the price goes up, you can sell and then return back the money you borrowed and so on. So in order to be able to do that first, you need to select, uh, let's say we want to borrow USDT, okay? And then we are going to borrow USDT. And what do we want to use as collateral? In this case, it is Bitcoin. So if your own case is, uh, if you have um, Ethereum, you have any other crypto asset you want to use, 
you go ahead and put that amount in the you select the token here okay or the coin so if i go ahead and say i want to borrow let's say um one hundred thousand dollars or let's say we want to borrow ten thousand okay so let's say we want to borrow ten thousand dollars it means that we need about two um, 0 0.429 Bitcoin, okay? This is what we are going to use as collateral. And then our daily interest rate, what we'll be paying daily is going to be 2, 0 0.2. That is, the daily interest rate that we are going to be paying will be 0.02%, okay? And then the term, how long do you want to borrow this money? You can go ahead and select that. Okay, so if I click on the drop down here, you see that you can go for as far as 180 days, okay? So if I borrow ten thousand dollars, okay, if I borrow ten thousand USDT for one hundred and eighty days, and I'm paying zero point zero two percent on a daily basis, it means that at the end of one hundred and eighty days, I am going to be paying three hundred and sixty USDT as interest, which is very very nice, okay. So the total of what you'll be paying at the end of the day will be. Um, ten thousand three hundred and sixty dollars and this is a very perfect interest rate okay so i can go ahead and borrow this and then at the end of the day i just pay back this money and whatever i make if i'm able to grow the ten thousand dollars in 180 days to fifteen thousand to twenty thousand dollars i'm only returning ten thousand three hundred and sixty um, USDT back to the OKS platform and here one thing you want to note is where it says liquidation okay um, this is your liquidation price so it means that when Bitcoin gets down to um, $25,000 you'll be liquidated okay because OKS want to play safe so that they'll be able to have money to pay those they are, that are, they are you know lending this money from okay to pay those they are borrowing this money from in order to borrow it to you they need to be careful. That's why there is a liquidation price, meaning that if Bitcoin gets to 25, your account will be liquidated. Okay? But since we are borrowing USDT, we can only play safe and always trade with this fund on a safe mode. All right? So with this, you can go ahead and, you know, borrow and pay, which is a good one. Okay? So um, basically, this is about the borrowing. It means that you have an asset, okay, like Bitcoin, Ethereum, you can use as collateral, and then you can borrow. Then, if you want to learn, let's say you don't want to borrow to trade, you don't want to pay interest at the end of the day to return your money, then your own option will be to lend your crypto, okay? You can come in here and click on the lend here, where it says lend. So, once you're on the lending interface there, you only have USDT, right? This is what you can right now invest with the OKS lending option, okay? And then you can go ahead and click on it. Once you click on it, it brings you to this interface. And on this interface, you just go ahead and see all that they're saying. The minimum you can invest is 50,000, okay? 50,000 USDT. And then you just scroll down and see all the details here. If you are satisfied with the terms and conditions, you just go ahead and click on I have read and agreed, okay? Then you click on next. So this is where you are going to put the amount you want to actually um invest okay so you just if you don't have the funds there you just click on transfer and then you can transfer it to your wallet okay transfer it to where it will be available and then you go ahead once you are done with that just go ahead and click on confirm and that transaction will be confirmed and once you confirm you can you know the this will start running for you meaning that at the end of 130 180 days you are going to get uh, you know the apy is 3.65 so whatever that amounts to if it is 1%, 2% in 180 days, that is what you are going to get in return. And this is somehow good, okay? If you don't know how to trade, you don't know how to do anything, and then you just want to let this money sit in your wallet, then the best thing to do is to actually go and lend it out for people to start trading with. And you can start benefiting the dividends. You know, you can start benefiting from whatever the percentage is for you okay so basically that is how you go about you know to borrow and to lend your crypto and if you want to participate in the other type of lending and that option i've made videos previously on that okay so it's to come in here to the end option and you see a lot of so once you're on the end interface there are a lot of other tokens okay that you can actually go and invest in all right a lot of them you can go and participate in and some are giving you Okay, on the N interface here, USDT here um, is giving about 604%, okay, APY, right? 
So if it is P2P loan, if you subscribe, that will give you 3.65%, which is what I showed initially. If it is for savings, you get about 1%. Then if you want to go for dual investment, okay, you get about 0.9 to 600%, depending on, you know, the amount you are subscribing with. So you see all of these different options that you can go ahead and invest in, okay? Dual investment is another big way or another good way you can invest your money with the OKS exchange and make money from it. So I just wanted to share this with you. I hope you like this video. If you are new to my channel and you gain value about this video, you like videos like this about making money online, about crypto trend and investing, then consider subscribing. Hit the notification bell to be the first to be notified each time videos like this are published and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to share it okay if you have any issue just leave a comment in using the comment section and i will definitely attend to your comments okay so that is it for this video and i'll see you guys in the next video